Good afternoon, everyone from the CU campus. We are one hour away from the top 10 Republican candidates facing off in a much anticipated debate. It's going to happen at the Coors Event Center, which is right behind us. These candidates haven't been on stage with each other for more than a month now, and the dynamics in this packed race, they have shifted oh, yeah. greatly. This is the candidates' first face-to-face -face meeting since national polls started showing Ben Carson getting an edge on Donald Trump. Carson has a six-point lead in this New York Times poll. There are also polls in Iowa, Texas, and Oklahoma also showing Carson in the lead. We have team coverage leading up to the debate. Mark Boyle has been on campus all day as students get ready for the school's moment in the spotlight. Russell Haythorne is in the free speech area set up for those who want their voices heard along with the candidates. And we're going to start with Mark Stewart in the spin zone inside the Coors Event Center right behind us. And Mark, you talked to some of the candidates as they arrived for this debate. And already this afternoon, we have seen many well-known names here in the spin room, here on the floor of the spin room, including Carly Fiorina, Ben Carson was here a short time ago, as well as Governor Bobby Jindal. The focus of this debate is the economy, and that's a broad, broad subject area. Everything from job creation to minimum wage to housing, even the marijuana industry, which is flourishing here in Colorado. When I was talking to the debate moderator yesterday, he said his goal is to have a conversation, not necessarily necessarily viewing this as an opportunity for canned statements. But for some of the candidates, that may be inevitable, including Carly Fiorina, who we talked to a short time ago. She was asked if this debate is really a make it or break it moment for her campaign. I'm excited for the debate. Yeah. Do you think you missed a moment between the last debate and this debate to kind of seize that momentum you gained after the debate? No. Why not? Well, look where I am on this stage. Look where I am. You know, August 6th, I wasn't on the stage at all. September, I had to fight my way on the stage. And now I'm in fourth. So Carly Fiorina making her presence known. And after the debate, many of the candidates and the supporters will come here and give their spin, their take on how things went. And it's not just Republicans. We have seen Governor Hickenlooper here, perhaps the most well-known Democrat in our state. Outside the Coors Event Center here, Governor Mar uh, Marvin, Oma Marvin O'Malley, who is running for president, the one of the Democratic uh, contenders. So this is just the beginning of what will be a very intense night here in Boulder. The question is, will moments here last until the rest of the campaign? Live at the Coors Event Center, Mark Stewart, 7 News.